Hey everybody, welcome to a Borderlands edition video and I'm going to be showing you how to use the uh, VA token exploits. So uh, just stay, after I show you how to do it, just stay after so I can explain some critical problems and uh, consequences of using this exploit. So I'm going to be using the two controller method which is exponentially faster for this. And so what uh, VA tokens do is they bring your stats up and they increase your character potential. So I'm going to show you actually twice so you can be uh, know for sure how to do it. And yeah, this is the yeah the quicker way uh, that I do it. So first you load up your character, it can be any of your characters on your profile. Uh, just make sure it's on it. And then what you do is you go back to the title screen. Now what you do, if you're using a second controller, is you'll go to another person's profile, um, use my sister's, and then I'll just load hers up. Right, and then what I'll do is I'll go back to the title screen. And then I'll go back to my bottle, which is the first one you saw, and it was sinking, and then it shows that I have an 364 additional VA tokens. Now, and then I go to the actual game. So what it actually does is it gives you all the tokens that you actually earned in game, and it uh, gives it adds them in addition to the ones that you already have. So I'm gonna go to the menu, and there you go. And now I'm gonna spend them. So. What I have to do is I have to spend them each time uh, I load up because they don't stack. Um, otherwise, if I did this again without stacking them, it would just show that I had uh, 361, I believe it was, tokens. And so that's kind of... So you have to do this every time, yeah, is what I'm saying. Um, yeah, as you can see, I've done this quite a few times. It doesn't increase your VA rank, it just gives you higher percentages. And so, yeah. So, if you keep just keep hitting the button, it just kind of spreads evenly to every stack. And this is easy to do while you're doing something else. So, what I'll do oftentimes is I'll, I'll read a book, type, or I'll watch Netflix on my laptop and then I'll just be doing this uh, with one hand while kind of multitasking with the other one. And from what I've heard, this works on both Borderlands 2 and Borderlands the pre-sequel on both PlayStation 4 and Xbox One. So yeah, it does take a little bit of time. Now kind of what they don't tell you is, um, what I've seen from other videos is that I mean, and there's lots of other videos on this, but they didn't tell me about uh, kind of some of the problems and some of the extra stuff that I would encounter. So I decided to create a video for you guys about it. So what they don't tell you is that this does apply, like like all of them. Um, some videos were specific and they said that you had to load up a certain character, but it does apply for all characters in your account regardless. And uh, a huge note is that um, if you haven't reached like a certain number, so like most of the time it gives you 0.2% uh, of whatever you choose token. Once you hit around, if you're doing it like I'm doing and it's spreading all evenly, once you hit around 180% for each thing, it goes down to about 0.1 PPT or a percent per token. So, and you can always, if you feel like you're too overpowered by doing this, you can always disable the stats and then uh, we do them. So, and then I'm going to show you the second time how to do this. So, quit. And what we're doing is we're going back to the character screen. So sometimes one secondary character may not work like the first, or well, I guess technically the second time I tried it, um, it was on my brother's account, and it for some reason would not load um, onto mine. And now we go back to the uh, the other profile, which is my sister's, and then we can quickly just. Go back to the title screen again, and go back to mine on my other controller, my first controller, 
And so when I used my brothers, it not only did it fail for me, but for some reason it reset all his VA tokens to only 25, whereas he had just as many as me. He had around uh, 350. Um, so now we're probably going to have to use the exploit on his character, which I won't show in this video. But the best suggestion from the mistake that I unintentionally made is to just kind of create a dummy character on a new profile, just so that you don't risk anything happening to your uh, secondary profile. And also uh, to upload your character, you know, just to have a saved one in the Gearbox cloud or whatever it is they use. Um, and if it, so if it doesn't work the first time or the second time, like it, and that happened to me, then just kind of try it again on a new character or on a new profile or a new character on a new profile. Now, what will occasionally happen is that the game will forget that you've completed some of your BA objectives and they'll reissue them to you. Um, this will this will increase your BA rank and it will reissue uh, customization skins if it, you know, if the completion of one it reissued a skin before. And so kind of feel free to just give those extra skins since you already have them in your account, I would assume, to a friend or to another profile. Or if you forgot to and you accidentally sold it, then you can it'll hopefully just randomly pop up the right one that you accidentally sold. Um, a heads up, if you go over 480 million BA rank um, as, well, Original Karma, uh, another YouTube uh, personality, not really personality, he's a gamer, said that the game will crash each time, so just, I mean, the odds aren't too often that you'll go over 480 million BA rank, but just, you know, just a heads up. So, kind of a, uh, why do this, you may wonder. Well, I was stuck at level 72, overpower 6 with 0, and I want to reach overpower 8, which is difficult kind of when you're playing legitly and you're playing solo, say. Um, you need like 3 to 4 players usually, on uh, normally. And so when my sister and I were connecting uh, kind of a four-player co-op co we were switching profiles and we initiated this the first time by mistake. Um, and after a little bit of research and I discovered that through this I could perform uh, this exploit multiple times. And so I got to use the, started to use the exploit, I got to around 240-ish percent um, and I still died um, when trying to get to overpower uh, 7. And it wasn't until I got to about 366% uh, that things start becoming very, very manageable. Uh, as you can see, I've gone much, much further overboard just because I kind of want to see my health um, really close. Now, maybe uh, uh, I'll hope to get it to around like eight, eight figures. But earning and getting gear has gotten so much easier after doing this. Like. It's so manageable. Like I've run Digipeak multiple times after I reached OP8, and it's it's so so easy. And so I've gotten a bunch of legendaries and a bunch of pearl essence, even though pearl essence aren't actually that great. Um, I've done, and so here we give a quick demonstration. Here's it without uh, my bonus stats. So here's it with it disabled as fast as I can. And then here's with it on. So quite a bit of difference, I have to say. So thanks for watching guys. If you want more Borderlands 2 content, let me know in the comments. And maybe I'll post some videos later if you guys have any requests. So thanks for watching guys.